So you can now make AI UGC content and in this video I want to cover a platform that I've been using to make some AI UGC content. It's called Creatify. It's a pretty decent platform, not sponsored by them in any way. Just want to make a quick little video on how to use it and show you guys what I'm doing with it. So as you can see here, I'm on their page right now. As you can see, Creatify, they have all this UGC content of people and girls talking about different products, whatever it may be. You do sign in, you could do generate your first ad for free, get started, whatever it is. I'm just going to sign in because I I already have an account so i'm gonna click sign in right here so i'm now in my dashboard i have 40 credits they work off a credit basis so i'm now going to go up to the top left right here where it says create i'm going to go to ai avatar and i'm going to now enter in a script for my ugc video now if you don't already have a script for ugc video we'll make one with chatgpt right now so i'll just go to chatgpt and once inside chatgpt we're simply going to create a ad with some desire let's say we're selling breathable underwear it's the most comfortable underwear you've ever worn in your entire life and that it's the number one selling underwear in the us let's just you know let's just go with that so i wrote a little prompt right here that says let's make a ugc script that's around 30 seconds for this underwear brand called hanes um hanes is a, a underwear brand that's already around i then said let's use the desired comfortable and breathable now i'm going to submit this tattoo is going to make a little script for me um it, it should be pretty good i want to ask him to take out the scenes because we actually really don't need the scenes i've actually never tried the scenes in creatify it might actually use ai content to make the scenes but i don't really think so so we're just going to ask to cut out the scenes so it came up with a kind of a subpar script where it says hey everyone just got my hands on the new hands underwear i can't wait to share how game changing these are that's not really compelling to the desire straight away of hey they're breathable they're comfortable. They're all this stuff. So what we're going to ask is we're going to ask ChatGPT to introduce the problem first and then add in the solution, which is the Hanes underwear that they got. So I just said, let's dial it like they have a problem at first and with bad underwear. And now they found Hanes and couldn't be happier. So as you can see right here, came up with a somewhat subpar script again, where it says, ever struggled with underwear that just doesn't get it right. I've been there, scratchy fabrics, poor fit and zero breathability. That actually isn't too bad. But now what ChatGPT has a hard time of doing is actually making this at a low or reading level so we're going to put this into Hemingway now what Hemingway does is actually tell you the reading level of all of the content that you put inside Hemingway so you can see I put this little paragraph that ChatGPT made into Hemingway and it's showing the readability is grade five and there's some words that we just really don't need in here they're kind of filler words so we're just going to get rid of these by clicking on it and clicking remove this is a really good platform to see if your copy has too high of a reading level and it's too hard to read then it's actually going to decrease your results in advertising so we got rid of kind of all those filler words and we're now going to just copy this and we'll now put this into Creatify where it says the script and we'll put the voice as female and we'll choose a different voice obviously we're going to want to do ultra realistic because that's going to come out the best we're going to do susan because i've actually had a really good time of using susan because it sounds a little bit younger it sounds a little bit more energetic and it overall just sounds a little bit better and then also we'll do it in a 9 by 16 so it worked best with reels now you could do any one of these people with the ultra realistic I highly recommend someone that fits your ICP. If you don't know what your ICP is, it's your ideal customer profile. So who's the majority you're selling to? Woman, men, whoever it may be. For now, we'll just go with this girl in the car and we'll click next. It is now going to start generating the AI UGC video. And then once it does that, it will probably take, you know, maybe a minute or two to generate that. It will have the voice ready to go of what it's actually saying in our script. It actually won't match the word of mouth right away. Once we start to export the video, it will match the word of mouth and come out super clean and hopefully it will come out super realistic to the point where it came and tell it's ai so as you can see here it produced the video it won't actually sync right now with the lips but it will show us a good preview of the audio and then also what it will kind of look like you could also add in photos of your product so it will show those on video too but we'll see how it looks right now and we'll see how it did ever struggled with underwear that doesn't get it right i've been there scratchy fabrics poor fit and zero breathability it was a daily annoyance, but then I found Hanes and wow, what a change. Their underwear is like a breath of fresh air, super comfortable fits, and the breathability is on another level. No more discomfort or sweaty days. Now I can move, work out, or relax without a second thought about my underwear. It's like I finally found the missing piece to my daily comfort. Hanes turned my underwear game around. 
Comfortable, breathable, perfect. I couldn't be happier. So it did well. It's not bad. It's not horrible. It has a really hard time of having tonality. It's kind of flat through the entire thing. As you can see, it said breathability, kind of wacky. It just has a hard time of having that tonality and sounding like a real person, but it's getting really good. So now as we have this video here, we'll click render and we'll click use our five credits and this will render out. It will take about 16 minutes it's saying right here and once it renders out we'll come back and see how it did with matching it to the lips of the actual person and after that we'll talk about if this is even usable and worth trying to advertise on facebook so it's done finishing the video um so we're gonna click on it right now and see kind of how it paired up with the text -to speech to the actual person struggled with underwear that doesn't get it right i've been there scratchy fabrics poor fit and zero breathability it was a daily annoyance but then I found Hanes and wow, what a change. Their underwear is like a breath of fresh air, super comfortable fits, and the breath ability is on another level. No more discomfort or sweaty days. Now I can move, work out, or relax without a second thought about my underwear. It's like I finally found the missing piece to my daily comfort. Hanes turned my underwear game around. Comfortable, breathable, perfect. I couldn't be happier. So as you can see, it matched pretty well but it has a weird time of kind of twitching and just doesn't look right with the tonality and the actual movements of her person it just doesn't really look right and if i was watching this as an ad i wouldn't click on it because i already know it's ai i already know it's ai ugc content and they're probably selling a pretty bad product if they're using ai ugc content now if i have a strong brand and i'm thinking about using ai ugc content don't do it i think this is going to ruin your brand now if you're looking for some quick cash yeah maybe try this throw some on tiktok you know add in your product photos see how well you can make this and then try to advertise it on instagram and facebook and tiktok so you got nothing to lose you don't have a strong brand yet you didn't build up a brand for three years and have a strong community around you now if you already have a strong community of people around you and you've built up a, a strong brand and people like you don't use this it's not going to be good for your brand it's not going to be a good look for your brand that you're using ai ugc content but like i said if you're a smaller brand that just started out and has absolutely no risk of using this content, then take the risk and try it. It may work, it may not. I've tried it with a couple of our campaigns and it hasn't worked too well so far. Maybe it's because of the scripts, but if you can really dial in the scripts of what they are saying, maybe it can be better. If you liked this video and you liked what you saw, I'm dropping more content like this all the time. So like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.